Hi guys, spotted this in Poundland for only 50 pence. And I thought, yeah, rubber band powered car. There might be a problem. If I wind it up too much, it's going to flex quite a bit. I could always put something on there to stiffen it, but I think we'll just go for it like it is. I've 3D printed this piece for the back. So it will slide on there like that. I need to try and make it straight, otherwise it will go off at an angle. I printed this piece for the front, which is basically the same as the back piece only with a bit that's going to go through the hole which means we can adjust the steering I did consider putting a thread on there and putting a nut on top to actually screw it tight and then I thought no I'll just wrap some rubber bands around it for now then for wheels I'll use my usual CDs with the 3D printed hubs and um, I'm using bicycle spokes for the axles. So I'll put it together and that should do. I've also got that little bit that I 3D printed for a previous car, which you put on the bicycle spoke to give us a little hook to hook the rubber band onto. I'll need to glue that in place though because it's a bit loose. There we are. So we've got an adjustable front axle. Get the steering straight. Bicycle spokes for the axles, CDs for the wheels, 3D printed hubs. Same at the back with my extra little bit there to hook the rubber band onto to make it easier. Normally I just wrap the rubber band round itself so it actually holds itself in place, but I thought I'd put that one on there. So the question is, how much will it flex as we wind the pressure up? I'll only use these cheap, thin rubber bands. We don't need to be very powerful to do the distance here. I think this will be more than enough. Or you could just use one or two and use a piece of cotton to actually reach the back axle. I'll do one more. Right, we need to make a little loop to hook it on the front. So, loop 
Over there. What to do? Trying to do this where you can see it. So over the hook. Wind it up. Right. We'll put it on the floor and see how well it goes. going left but we should be able to adjust that quite easily I just turn in the steering right a bit Yep, that worked. See if we can hit the camera. Got my wireless microphone on so you can hear me talking at this end. The only disadvantage with using the wireless microphone like this is you don't actually hear the car when it hits the camera. Which is a bit of a um, bit of a shame. Right, try and point that fairly straight. That works, no trouble at all. It didn't bend as much as I thought it would but then we're not using much power to get the distance. So yeah, that's a little beauty that. I like that one. I won't bother making the 3D files available unless somebody asks me. Because unless you happen to have a pound land nearby, you're not going to be buying one of those fly swats. <laughs> 